I do a national television for the sake of our viewers. Now, this is uh, what we call a, a color board uh, that will help you match the right color to your skin tone. And what are you laughing at? No, no, seriously. No, no, no. no earlier no, on, I thought you don't remember that cartoon that we uh, had uh -huh, uh -huh. where they have flowers and they've got a face in the flower. You look like that earlier. But thank, you know what? Thank you so much. Yeah. I think. Yes, but then again, I'm confident about my personal image. Thank you very much. <laughs> and uh, I think I've got too much confidence. I don't need this board. But I'm sure there are those of you out there who are still unsure of your identity, who you really are. And of course, it affects your self-esteem. It mm -hmm. affects uh, the way you meet people, the way you interact with people as well. That's right. We're talking about another series of the Singles mm -hmm. Cruise Asia. And this mm -hmm. is a little segment that they have on personal grooming and image and styling. So mm -hmm. please welcome on set, 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 set. Set, 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 set. Our guest who's been with us a few times already yes. on The Breakfast Show, Ms. Murshida Said, who's an image speaker. She's a personal grooming expertise, mm -hmm. uh, expert, sorry. Yes, yes, and of course she's going to share her expertise with us right here Thank on The Breakfast you. Show, especially when, uh, when we're talking about discovering personal style. Now, style means different things to different yeah. people, right, Murshida? Yes, Nas, mm -hmm. um, a lot of times people think of style and they think of fashion. You yes. Know? Oh, or uh, uh, we have to have a nice style or mm. what kind of fashion or what kind of hairstyle you mm -hmm. wear what kind of handbag you carry what kind of shoes yeah, yeah, right yeah. but style is actually more than just that mm -hmm. all right if a style what i love about style and why i wanted to talk about style today is right. because i saw this quote by Yisan Laurent he said uh -huh. fashion's fade style is eternal wow. you know wow last forever you know style because if you have style people will remember you because your mm -hmm. style is your brand mm -hmm. which i will talk mm -hmm. about uh, a bit more mm -hmm. now style is actually a projection of the person's internal and it's uh sh it's showcased at how you carry yourself mm -hmm. Star style is not just about the clothes that you wear the the fashion that you carry or, or the makeup style well, huh? makeup and all that mm -hmm. but it's more about how you speak how your body language is, how you interact with people, that is style also. Mm -hmm. you know, so when we talk about that on the single screws, mm -hmm. um, we'll be addressing not only the colours but also the, the, the etiquette, the body language. Mm -hmm. And we work, style development mm -hmm. is working in tandem with personal development, which a lot of people don't know about. You know, mm -hmm. They say, oh, style is style. Mm -hmm. Personal development is personal development. Mm -hmm. It is not. It is very much interrelated because mm -hmm. who you really are, mm -hmm. when it comes out, when you know who you are, you'll be comfortable with the clothes that you wear, mm -hmm. Or you'll be more confident and you'll be happy with whatever you're wearing because it's not right for me to tell you you must wear certain things you know mm -hmm. and you don't feel good about that mm -hmm. but that's just it it's almost like a catch-22 because let's say I'm a hippie at heart mm -hmm. so I want to wear my more bohemian looking yeah she likes her flower, stuff, flower, flower, flower power skirt yeah, yeah. you know my loose Bangles. garments and stuff like that <laughs> but then um, it's not stylish because you know you just look like any ordinary Gwen Stefani goes wannabe, wrong. wannabe you know thing. what I mean you know, yeah. Yeah. so how how do you how do you right. teach style? Now, style is actually a lot about confidence. You know, how you carry that style. If you were a bohemian at heart, mm. I know exactly what you mean because I'm a bohemian as well. You know, when I was in school, I was wearing gypsy clothes all the time. You know, but it is how confident you are being able to stand out from the crowd mm -hmm. and yet look comfortable with whatever it is and be able to fit in at the same time, you whatever. know, in certain occasions. So you're a firm advocate of whatever makes you happy when you wear it, mm -hmm. you should keep on wearing it. Keep on wearing it as long as it doesn't go overboard some things. You uh -huh. know, there's some basic rules about how much the eye can actually take if you're uh -huh. wearing like over too many accessories or you're wearing too many branded things on your on your body, on your mm -hmm. head and, mm -hmm. and everything, it just gets a bit overboard because how people see mm -hmm. is also a, it's a perception. Mm -hmm. So um, basically the rule is people cannot see more than eight items on your body as oh. in terms of accessories. Oh, right. So I am one of those people who do not advocate, you know, your gelang until up to here. <laughs> no, but, 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 well, won't people get sort of offended in the sense that, oh, if, if I like to wear more accessories than most people... Ayla, that's, uh, my, that's, my personal, that's my style. My personal style yeah. Uh, yeah. That's my style. If you're saying uh, I, I like to showcase uh, that I'm rich or this and that. Uh, <laughs> then is there something wrong with my personal development? No, that's fine with them. If they're happy with it, I say okay because we cannot judge people, right? True. But what, yeah. what I would say is if let's say somebody says, I want to improve myself and I want to, to be able to look good in the eyes of other person, mm -hmm. all right, then these are the things that we we, adv we, we would advise. You know, mm -hmm. okay, maybe there will be a bit over when you put a bracelet all the way up to your arms, mm -hmm. so maybe we'll cut down a little bit here and there. Ah. You know, maybe your, your brooch over here is not <laughs> right. You know, you look like Princess Leia. Let's take out somewhere, somewhere and put it somewhere else. So we'll just help to readjust, and yet they feel comfortable about that, mm -hmm. you know? Um, and that, that is how I work with them. And when you want to discover about personal style, sometimes we ask them, what is it that you want to change? What mm -hmm. is it that you want to improve? about yourself so that would also help mm -hmm. in terms of um, personal development and also style development mm -hmm. we 
work with people who actually want to improve themselves. Ah, yeah. So basically, very that's that's uh, very this. Yeah. Okay. Well, earlier on, of course, we saw Nas donning that little flower power chart. Mm, it's called a color wheel. chart. Color, yes. color, color wheel. I call it color, color wheel. wheel. Yeah. Color wheel. And right. um, how? So these are does cool colors. Uh, these yeah. for clothes. Yeah. yeah. Um, how to match the the the, uh, the right color of clothes to your your personal self. So this is cool clothing, and this is warm, warm. clothing. Yeah. There are a lot of ways where you can test whether you are cool or warm. Mm -hmm. When I test with people, and this is something I'll be doing on the 13th of October mm -hmm. yeah, at, a, uh, at a workshop that we're organizing before the single we'll screws. Mm -hmm. Yes, um, I'll be doing a color uh, uh, analysis mm -hmm. and this is a basic one mm -hmm. where what we'll do is simply to just um, have a warm and a cool colors mm -hmm. to see which one looks better on the person. Okay, okay. let's put it on Daphne. So, let's since Daphne, on Daphne is the closest to me. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, it's a warm so or a yeah. yeah. cold person. But Daphne, you must smile okay. because mm -hmm. uh, okay. if not both won't look nice. Smile. Yeah, so this is smile. warm and uh -huh. this is cool. You know, actually before this I saw her Whoa, okay. and I think she looks good in both. Yeah. Right? Yeah, she's one she of looks, those lucky people. Yeah, she's it? one of those lucky girls. <laughs> she can look yeah. look in good good in both. But I think cool yeah, really yeah. enhances her colours better. Oh, really? Yeah. So um this So does this mean you're a cool person? <coughs> maybe. Oh, maybe. My so watch out. No wonder she is a very cool person. The <laughs> queen is back. Yeah. And I'll be giving away a colour chart as well mm -hmm. where it uh it helps people in shopping, whether they want certain colours or makeup and clothes, because oh, sometimes right. you see, you know, you go shopping, you pick up, oh this is this is a blusher I like. This lipstick looks good on that model, you know, mm -hmm. but it doesn't suit on their face because they're mixing that's warm true, and cool colors. True. This one is brown, this one is purple, you know, and then when uh, you put together, it hey, doesn't look, I don't look as pretty as Daphne I think, yeah, you know, so, so you know. <laughs> I <gotta> lie. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so why? Because it's the uh -huh. colors, sometimes we choose the, the colors that does not enhance that's our, true, our that's looks. True. So, so, um, this is I, for you. Are you also trying to say that even um, a lack of confidence is a problem in which you don't know what to choose. Overconfidence is a problem as well, mm, isn't yeah. it? I mean, th th yes. tell us a little bit more about that. Okay. Especially those who are like so confident. <laughs> 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 okay, okay. Share, spill. But it's a problem that needs to yes. be addressed. Yes. Now that is something that we work. That's why in my in, even in my consultations on image, I cover mm. the body, mind, heart, and spirit. Wow. Mm. The ego okay. is. The one that is the overconfidence, which I am better than everybody else. What do you have to say about yeah, how exactly. I can improve? I can tell you how you can improve. You know that sort of thing. So that is the ego, and that is the danger uh -huh. about a lot of uh, people. Mm -hmm. And when we go into the body, mind, heart, and spirit, and we address this part about the ego, mm -hmm. the ego is actually the one that can not only destroy yourself but mm -hmm. also a lot of people around you, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So um, uh, when we address that, and people will, you know. We have the realization that okay, as long as you are willing to learn mm -hmm. and le willing to improve and be able to know how you you can add value to the world, mm -hmm. right? That is something that will bring down our our ego a little bit, you excellent, know? Excellent. Yeah. So, so that, a bit that, of humble pies. Yes. <laughs> and anybody who is interested in personal development, all uh, all style development for that matter, mm -hmm. would have a, a lesser of an ego, you mm -hmm. know, and they are more willing yeah. to learn. That so is something. So be more aware of yourself as yeah. well, your strengths and weaknesses. Yeah. yeah. But I mean. Not, not just colours, yeah, no. Daphne. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're talking about uh, uh, simple no no-nos. I mean, there are things you, that you do be just before a date to My clean yourself. My pet peeve is, I mean, you can be wearing any sort of budget as long as it's clean, mm. but please be clean. Just uh -huh. personal hygiene is God, number uh, one, yeah. right? Ooh. Yes, and that is the basic thing that I always emphasise. You know, you may, no matter how beautiful you are, you know, you have, uh, you choose the right colours, will you Mm. You put on the right makeup, everything looks perfect, and mm. then when you hello, nice to meet you, ha ha ha, you know, the uh, breath yeah. that comes out. You know? uh, <laughs> there you go. I mean, that's yeah. a total who, you know, no, that's a real no no. Two basic no no's, two basic things that, that they call the deal breakers are the breath uh -huh. and the body odor. Breath so, and body yes, odor. these are the, the basic things, you know, mm -hmm. because uh, hygiene is pers uh, personal hygiene is really important. Mm -hmm. And then we'll go into other things like your etiquette is also very important because, mm -hmm. yeah, you can look good and you can have all everything, your personal hygiene is good. Mm -hmm. But the way you you make the other person feel mm -hmm. the uh, bad or cholo not. too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, no self respect and yes, no yes. respecting others. You know mm -hmm. that is also a, a big no no. So so, so, so you're going to be covering all this in your workshop on the 13th of October. Mm -hmm. On the 13th it's uh, going to be from 7 p.m. until okay. 10 p.m. There will mm -hmm. be the three of the other gurus, who is mm -hmm. the love guru, the dating coach, mm -hmm. and myself. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. So we finally got everybody's schedule because we're all traveling <laughs> all over the place. So we finally got everybody. 
write it down and we're going to share this with singles. Mm -hmm. So it will be held at Milia Hotel, oh, right, um, on the 13th of October. So I think uh, the, the registration is on. You can go to singlescruiseasia.com mm -hmm. and the number is there, yeah, right? Maybe. And I will be sharing on the colour harmony part. Uh -huh. But on the ship, I will be doing a lot more than mm -hmm. that. Yeah. So the basic things that each and every one of us will be covering is we're giving uh, some freebies as well. And I believe um, uh, the, the love gurus are going to speak on um, uh, what's that? The soul searching, yeah, soul -searching, yeah, uh, high, uh, yeah, mm -hmm. uh, soul searching as well as uh, for me, I'll be doing on colors, mm -hmm. and um, Andrew is Andrew is going to be speaking on uh, mm -hmm. dating, dating yeah. coach, yeah. Right. So a little sneak preview of what to expect on the Singles Cruise Asia. Mm -hmm. One more time, of course, for more information, uh, check out the website www.singlescruiseasia.com or call this number one more time zero one two three three zero seven 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 two seven. Yes, one more time. That's the number to call. And uh, well, uh, please. Places are running out as we speak, so of course make your bookings quickly. It's at Melia Hotel, 7 till 10 p.m. Three most it's important as if hours. This workshop is calling for me, Nas. Really? <laughs> yes. You don't need grooming, Daphne Aiki. No, I'm just, it's a workshop for singles. Oh, you know, we're not talking about the cheese singles. So you're gonna singles. go for the singles workshop to work it or to learn? To learn, work it, and do the whole thing. Really? Yeah. yeah All right. Well, thank you so much to Moshida, and uh, good luck thank on you. your uh, workshop with the rest and with the you. team. Yeah. And thank you for shining the light on many, many people who do need them as well. And the thing is, for yeah. viewers, it, it takes it's a big step for you to actually admit that, okay, I may need help a little bit when it comes to personal grooming. So don't be afraid, yeah? That's what we like to see on The Breakfast Empower Show. Empower yourself knowledge. Mm -hmm. All right, we're going to go for another quick break here on The Breakfast Show. But stay tuned because we have something for Malaysian Twinkle Toes. Yes. Yeah.